In this video, we will be demonstrating how to integrate ALM Octane with UFT via Jenkins. This allows Octane to execute UFT tests in Jenkins from GitHub as a source code management repository. We will need these components. First, ALM Octane. Second, Jenkins with the MicroFocus Application Automation Tool plugin. Third, GitHub as the source code management repository. Fourth, Unified Functional Testing UFT1. So let's get started. First off, we need an API key for the Octane workspace. This is in the Octane Space Administration under API Keys. This key requires the role CI CD integration for our workspace so that Jenkins can access Octane. Be sure to copy the API key in secret somewhere safe, as once created, the API secret cannot be regenerated. Next, if we haven't already, for Jenkins we need the MicroFocus Application Automation Tool plugin. It's available from Manage Jenkins, Manage Plugins. Once complete, we enter the plugin settings for the ALM Octane CI. This consists of the Octane URL, the client ID, this is the API key client we generated in the previous step, the client secret, which is the API key secret, and the Jenkins user for whom Jenkins will be executing the jobs. Test the connection, then hit save. For the UFT side, Git manages the local source code repository. UFT saves scripts to Git locally. GitHub is a cloud-based source code repository. Changes can be committed and pushed to GitHub. Although UFT can be installed on the same machine as Jenkins, it is recommended that UFT is installed on a separate machine and set up as a slave node. The UFT node name needs to start with UFT so the plugin can know which node to execute UFT scripts. The agent should be installed to run as a service. Potentially, you want to have a farm of UFT nodes. Now let's go back to Octane and connect the pieces. Go to Workspace Management. Click the DevOps tab. Define the CI server. This is the Jenkins link and will show up automatically after you've defined the Octane CI in Jenkins. Next, define the test runner. Give it a name. The framework is UFT. The CI server is what we've just defined previously. The SCM type is Git, and the repository is the GitHub URL. And then provide the GitHub username and password to authenticate the GitHub connection. Test the connection, then hit save. This will create a job in Jenkins, which will populate the tests from GitHub into the Octane workspace. You can check the job in progress by clicking the build number and then console output. Now back in Octane, under quality tests, we can see that the tests are populated under unassigned. Now let's run these tests from Octane. First, we'll create a test suite. Next, we'll add the tests, and then select Run Suite. Fill out the form and click Let's Run. 
We can view the run in progress from Jenkins by clicking the job number and select console output. When the job is complete, the test results will be visible in ALM Octane. So in summary, we have integrated ALM Octane with Jenkins using an API key. We set GitHub as the shared UFT script repository. In Octane, we define Jenkins as a CI server, and we define the test runner where the Jenkins CI server will execute UFT tests using the GitHub link as the repository. This has been Microfocus. Thanks for watching.